Okay, so today I'm going to be changing the oil on a Polaris Razor XP1000. And I'm going to be showing you how to do it. Alright, so step one, you got to let the engine... Oh, by the way, you need... Well, I'll go over that later. But anyway, okay, so step one, you need to start the engine and let it run for a little bit. So, like so. Start it. Let it run for a little bit. And get it all, get all the oil heated up and get all the stuff out of it. Just let it run for a little bit. And then you'll shut it off. I'm going to count to about 30. One, two, three. So it's getting, it's getting warm. Alright, so that's about good enough time. That's probably around 30 seconds there. I'm going to give it about five more. One, two, three, four, five. Alright, yeah. Alright, so let it run for a little bit. And now, what you want to do is... You want to come back here and get this this panel off right here. There's in the seats between the seats. There's this little panel right here, and you can just simply slide it off like that, and that gives you access to your oil pump or yeah, right there. And to get that off. All you gotta do is, I don't know if I need a wrench, I don't know, is I'm gonna try, I don't have very good camera, man. Let me get, let me get, I get a camera feed for y'all. And, get it changed. Probably can't see me very good. Or if you can see me. I don't know if you can, but. Uh, hang on. This is terrible. Alright. I just saw this holding the camera. Alright. So, anyway. You'll come back here. And. You'll try to get it undone. By hand. Which I can. So, that's good. And. Screw that off. Or screw that back on. Because I forgot to put the towel there. Yeah, you want to make sure you put a towel there so oil doesn't drip everywhere. And I did not do that. Oh. Hang on. Yeah, good advice. Lesson learned. Put a towel there. Forgot to do that. Oh, okay. I'll clean all that up later. But, I want to stick a towel up. Whenever you're doing that, because it likes to leak. 